We start tonight at 6 with a senior prank gone wrong. A cow that got loose from a group of high school students in Niles. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman live in Glenview where a group of wranglers had to come in and get that cow to safety. Marissa? Yeah, that's right, Joe and Marie. The staff here at Wagner Farm were called in by police after they finally were able to track down this car, get the cow rather, get this, after about six hours. We now know these students bought this cow on Craigslist. Oh, and a pig too. Now Niles has beef with these students who say they could have put this animal at risk. I've never seen a cow run down my street and I hope to never see one again. CBS 2, the first to bring you this video captured by Roger Plummer, a heifer on the run in his Niles neighborhood and students chasing after it. Niles police say Northridge Prep High School seniors had planned a senior prank to get this cow, a pig and some chickens loose inside their school. You're watching it and thinking, is this real? Three police departments and the park district all responded. Once it was corralled, video shows the staff at Wagner Farms in Glenview wrestling the heifer to the ground, trying to get it safely inside a trailer. We created a, a funnel out of fence panels to get it to the trailer, but we knew when it got there, that's where it was going to get rough. Jonathan Keister with Wagner Farm says this could have been dangerous for both the students and the animal. His fear, the cow could have been hit by a car. It was tough enough for two of us that know how to work livestock to handle them, so I don't know how some high school kids thought they were going to do it. Um, but. I, I don't think that pre-planning was part of, you know, what went into this. They also plan to bring chickens from a student's home inside the school. Somewhere, somehow, this went south. These were not pets. Those animals were terrified, obviously. And uh, when you don't know how to handle those things, this is what happens. Well, the team here at Wagner bought, brought the cow to an animal sanctuary in Woodstock temporarily. It will be soon up for adoption. Those students were cited by the village of Niles. Their school, though, did not return our request for comment. We're live in Glenview. I'm Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Joe Marie. All right. I think they're going to have an FFA program at the school, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Starts on Monday. Yeah. yeah. Uh, thanks, thanks, Marissa. <laughs>